I'm Brian Leslie with the South Dakota Department of Transportation report on construction of the new I-90X at Fort Dean Interchange at Spearfish, South Dakota for the week of March 20th. Well, the 2017 construction season will begin the week of March 20th and is scheduled to run through November 9th of 2017. Now, the project's overall completion date is June 1st, 2018, if need be. But the uh, prospects are things will get completed well before then. On March the 16th, a public meeting was held in Spearfish to update citizens on the progress. DOT project engineer Adam McMahon reported that the $28 million project is about two-thirds complete. Uh, we got the interstate all done last year, which is, which is ahead of schedule. Um, we also got Colorado Boulevard and the south end of 27th Street uh, substantially complete, uh, which is ahead of schedule. Um, and then with, with that, we, had, we delayed some of the work on the north end of 27th Street to this year. Bridge demolition of the old overpass is complete as far as the removal of the girders over the I-90 lanes. The support structures will be removed within the next few days and that will necessitate some one lane traffic in each direction on I-90 for safety reasons. And by the way, the old concrete from the old overpass is being recycled into the new project or into other building materials. Well, here's a look overall at the 2017 construction schedule, which is, of course, always dependent upon the weather. Now, within just a few days, demolition work will be completed on the old bridge. Starting March 20th, cleanup work will begin along Colorado Boulevard. And also starting March 20th, the traffic signals here will be removed at the top of the westbound ramps and then work on creating temporary surfacing on 27th Street north of the bridge will take place. That will kind of straighten out that traffic jog that exists right now if you're coming off the bridge going north. Very soon, traffic will be routed to the two lanes on the east side of 27th Street, as you can see right here, and that will allow crews to wreck the old lanes and begin grading for the widened 27th Street in this area. Concrete work on the project is expected to resume around April 17th. Early on, much of that work will center on the medians and approaches on Colorado Boulevard, including in front of White's Canyon Motors and the turn onto 26th Street at Connex. Further down the road in May, June, and July, work will progress on building the other half of the new bridge with girders being lifted in place during a July time frame. Now, when that happens, it will be done during overnight hours and traffic will again be routed off I-90 onto the off on ramps, kind of the same as we had during bridge demolition here recently. And again, that will be around the mid-summer uh, sometime in July. Well, a reminder from the Department of Transportation, if you're driving through the area, slow down through the work zones and be watching for increased construction equipment and workers that will be returning to the job site. As always, road construction information for this project can be found at these locations as it becomes available. I'm Brian Leslie. Thank you for watching the South Dakota Department of Transportation update right here on BlackHillsChannel.com.